Oh, it must be Friday. <laughs> it must be Friday. We're all lit up today. Yeah. What, what are we playing? We're playing good stuff. We're playing good stuff? Okay. <laughs> all I heard was my intro music. Now all of a sudden I heard something else. I was like, what's what's going on in here? What's happening? What's happening? We have the Nikki Scolera in the hey! house. I'm so happy. I haven't seen you in so long. I know. It's been a while. We were catching up at Top of Show talking about mm-hmm. life liberty and the pursuit of our love and happiness <laughs> mm-hmm. she's been one busy little girl for sure I know. you have a six and six and a half year old yeah he's jack six is six and a half year old now mm-hmm. and uh and we, obviously as you can tell we're alive with holiday in here we yes. have our elf on the shelf behind me mm-hmm. i guess he'd be elf on my on my shelf and then <laughs> um we have the vintage we had the vintage ones today mm-hmm. um which, which uh, Nikki was pointing out, I haven't seen these before. We, uh, my husband and I just moved into a house. Yes, and my mom, thank you. And my You're mom welcome. has decided in her house the things that she wants to rid herself of <laughs> now get to find a home in our home. So these are her vintage uh, elves on the shelves. And They're we have cute. a stand in for Brandon. Aww. Oh, that was that, that right. A stand in for, for Brandon. Who's at home watching? He is sick today, Aww. Brandon. We love you. Get better. Please. Yeah, I don't know if he has a flu or. Ugh. Y'all sing so much, you know, I oh, would imagine, yeah. you know, I'd imagine. Th- and this is why we're dry today. We're both drinking our assorted mm-hmm. things to assorted keep our. Assorted healthy mm-hmm. beverages. Me, only because I'm not drinking. I have a hoarse voice. I sound like a jazz singer today. Mm. And then you, because you sing at five o'clock today. I do. Because Nikki's newest thing, which we're going to get into, is the cocktail cabaret over at the Cleopatra's Barge. Is it still called the Barge? It is indeed. It is the Barge at Caesar's Palace. Mm -hmm. So you can go have Nobu across the way and then go listen to her for her cocktail hour. And you are joined by several people on this. Yeah. Or you can come have cocktails first and then go. Probably, yeah. Because then you'd be early bird special if you're eating at five. Right. Well, the show's at five. Right. So See, I you could have a late already. lunch. You have you have a late lunch and then <laughs> and then go out afterwards. But this is going to be really fun to talk about. Um, of course, you know, at top of show, we kind of talk about what we did over the week. And I was oh. absent last week. Um, Brandon was here. He was here with the lovely gentleman from Tenors of Rock. Oh, cool! I forgot his name already. I I planned on it. I'm sorry. He had fabulous hair. Tommy, Tommy. Shelton. Shelton. That's my family's last name. Is it really? Yes, it is the Sheltons. They wow. come from North Carolina. So I was gone mm. because we went back east to visit um, Jason's family. Nice. And, uh, you know, I have, we know we have a few photos to roll of that in a second. Um, <laughs> we, um, we actually went to, uh, speaking of the elves, we, uh, they had a small, a small town, Bluefield. Was that West Virginia or Virginia right there? Virginia. Because it's right on the border of Bluefield, West Virginia and Virginia. Okay. And so they had an elf on the shelf parade. Yes. And every... I think everybody in the entire town who had a vintage car pulled their car up for this actual parade. Awesome. It was so fun because it was, you know, it's a small town. Everybody was there that, you know, you run into people from high school, right? You guys can yeah. talk out there. You're mic'd if you know that now. Yeah. <laughs> it's like he's answering a question for the, yes. for the judge. Yes. 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 Um, vintage cars. And they were throwing candy out at the audience, which was really funny because they were throwing it kind of low. Every time. And then I think there's a picture of the elves that came through towards the end of it. But they had, you know, kids that were in the parade. Oh, and, and Santa himself. Santa himself was there. What Santa. a guy. It's Santa. <laughs> <laughs> and there we go. <laughs> Keely and Jay out in the audience. I know him. Uh, I think that might be. Oh, maybe there is one more picture of the elves, of the children elves. Oh, there oh, we are. Yeah. So they, and then you could go have your photo taken in the big lot with the tree with the major elf. What is the elf lady's name then? You have the regular elf, and there's a woman. What? Peppermint. Peppermint. Yes, Peppermint's Patty. (laughs) She leaves them around the house Uh like our dogs do. Oh. Um, We also, this is exciting, because I I did say I would call this person at 12.05. It's 12.05. Oh, excellent. So for the entire... For the entire last month on House Seats, it was our 12th anniversary of House Seats. So we've been doing this business, not this show, for 12 years. I would look a lot older, (laughs) but Keely makes me look younger. Um, We have been doing the website for 12 years. So we gave away so many prizes on the site, including, I'm going to talk about some of these prizes. We gave away prizes to um, 12 people are going to jump off the sky jump with me at the stratosphere. Yeah. Sounds and one great. of them is going to be Miss Nikki's Clinton. No, it's not. No, I'm not doing it. You have no idea. We went to Are the Magical afraid? Forest the other day uh-huh. with, with Travis and Jen Cloer. Mm-hmm. And Jen was like, come on, let's go down the Arctic slide. And I was like, no, oh, no, 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 and no. And how no. big was the Arctic slide? Just I mean, <laughs> like a kid slide? Yeah, or? it's like a kid slide. <laughs> She's laughing so hard. Oh I was like, God. no, I'm good. I'm really good. She's really? like, what are you afraid of? I was like, I just don't need to. I'm all right. I'm okay. 
You don't. Are you afraid of heights or the going down of something? It's the stomach drop sensation. Okay. Like you know when you're on the swings sure. and you get or an that, airplane that has turbulence. Right. Or if you're driving down the hill too fast. Or yeah. sometimes you're not even driving down the hill too fast. You're just driving. And- uh huh. Yeah. So that it's, stomach thing. It's terrible. Where the stomach ends up in your in your neck. Yeah, you kind get of that feeling. like that. And some people must really enjoy That's a that high sensation. For a lot of uh-huh. yeah, yeah, yeah. Not me. Mm. Nope. And I'm just like I remember I'm, when I did Tarzan, we had to wear harnesses and like fly around the set. I was like, <laughs> and I terrified. booked the show, and I was like, how am I going to do this? Like, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I can't even ride the swings. Oh my god. And then at the end of the day, I they were like, oh, Nikki's really just here to cover Jane. <laughs> Oh, and I never even, I didn't even have to wear a harness in the show. I was like a you line just, carrier. Yeah, you're, you're, <laughs> she's like, I'm just going to stay on but the I ground. But I did do it. Yeah, I, yeah, mean, yeah. I, had sure, to, sure. I had to do it during rehearsals because it was the whole like evolution of a show. You know, they don't know exactly how it's going to shake down. But So would you be scared if you like walked out? So like a, a high balcony in a in a place? No, or, but no. I don't want to jump off the balcony. Oh, well, I, I don't want you to. Go. Yeah. yeah. No. And, um, and, and when I did We Will Rock, you remember the, oh, yeah, the, yeah. the Vasquez family, right? They're they are all here, yeah. and they they're the fabulous flying Vasquez mm-hmm, family, mm-hmm. and they have a they have a whole um, like trapeze yeah, rig set sure. up in their backyard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I got Tarzan, and I was like, I should probably come over and get a head start on this because like I haven't <laughs> I got a note to get out of gym class. Okay, everybody. <laughs> And uh, and I went over mm-hmm. there and I like climbed up, you know, this skinny little plexiglass ladder, yeah, like yeah. outside in in the backyard. And I'm standing on a, a little circle, circular dish, uh, looking up over the mountains of Las Vegas. It was yeah, beautiful. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, I did not want to get off of it. I was like, so it's not a height issue. No, it's and just the going through. I didn't something. do it. I yeah. was like, everybody was there and they're like, come on, just hold on and swing. And I was like, I'm good. I'm not going to do it. No, thanks. <laughs> Nikki doesn't like swinging. I don't. I'll just ask her husband. <laughs> um, so Sorry. One of, what's her fine? You're fine. So one of the last prizes left. Mm-hmm. And, and this this person that I'm going to call who won, you know, we picked the names right after the promotion ended on the 30th. And we've been holding on to this name oh. for over a week. So I'm <gasps> sure... Everyone's excited to know who it is and stuff. So this this member that that, that my office sent me I, thinks I'm calling her to get a review about her time at Carrot Top. Oh, good. She saw Carrot Top, and I'm supposed to call her, and they told her I'd call her about 12.05. The owner of House Seats would call her and ask her about her Carrot Top experience. Oh, Santa down. So, oh. <laughs> Come on up, dude. There you he's, go. Whoa. He, he's, he's carrying all the... Oh, oh, my God. Don't touch the okay, elf, don't whatever touch you do. Don't touch anything, Bryce. Sorry, honey. <laughs> all right, I have to star six, is it star 67 to block your number? Because I don't want her to have my cell phone number. <laughs> 702. Oh, don't give out her number. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What is her name? Heidi. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Oh, oh, this is hard. <clears throat> I wonder if you can hear. Can I put it on the speakerphone? There you go. Yeah, that's a smarter idea. Well, there you go. Is that better? My husband's going to come fix the Wardrobe. props. Hello? Hi, is that Heidi? This is Heidi. Hi, Heidi. This is Bryce calling from House Seats. Hi, Bryce from House Seats. Hi, I understand my office called you to let you know that uh, I'm calling you to get your uh, a review about Carrot Top that you saw just the other day. Oh, yeah. They scared me when they called. I thought, oh, shit, I signed up for a show and I didn't show up. <laughs> You're like, you bitch did not show up to the show. Oh, I'm sorry. You swore I swore. I just felt like it was appropriate. That's okay. I have potty mouth. Um, so you're asking for a review on Carrot Top, huh? I'm asking specifically how, how was the box office when you went? Were they nice to you? Oh, they were super nice. Yeah, it was super easy. Got in. Actually had good seats. Oh, good. Nice. That's nice. Um. Well, oftentimes they give our members theater. nice seats, you know, because they want it to look full. Yeah. So, yeah, no, we were we were right right in the center, and um, you yeah, know, the seats were great, the place was great. Carrot Top was so fucking funny. Oh, oh he's God. fun. He's fun. He's a riot. I had, I didn't expect a lot. I'll be honest with you, it's Carrot Top, redhead. I don't know what to expect, you know. Yeah. I about fell off my chair. I was laughing so hard. Great show. Loved it. Loved do, it. Do you do you know what his real name is? We can give that away. On that. No. His real name is Scott. No, no. Oh, Scott. His name is Scott. Scott? Scott Carrot. Scott. Well, I don't know if his, I forgot what his last name is, but his name is Scott. He's really nice. <laughs> Mr. Carrot. Mr. Carrot. Mr. <laughs> Mr. Carrot to you, but Scott is his real name. Oh, well, my goodness. No, he, he doesn't look like a Scott. Oh, he, yeah. He, well, he looks he, like a carrot. <laughs> so. He looks like a 
a Ben. A Ben. I'm gonna tell him that next time I see him. You know, I have the I have a restaurant here in town. He often comes for brunch. So if you ever want to run into him, he he's often there and he likes to take pictures with people. So. Oh, nice. oh I'm gonna stalk him now. He is so oh, funny. Uh oh. He hey, Scott. Actually, he, he actually, I know comedians good when I pee a little. Oh. <laughs> Um, Heidi, I just want you to know also, I have, I have you on speakerphone and we do a podcast every, (laughs) every Friday we do a house seats podcast live. So you are on the air right now talking about Kara Top. Everybody knows I pee to Kara Top. That's okay. I pee all the time. We're peeing right now. It's okay. (laughs) It's because we're drinking tea and cold beverages. So we're, you know, everyone in the audience is peeing too. So happy hour. Happy hour. I know. So listen, actually, the real reason for my call is not just for Carrot Top. Um, Okay. You you you've committed a bad crime on the website. Just kidding. No. Um, Oh. So I I don't know that you're aware. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. I'm just joking. Um, My heart's pounding. I'm so excited. So I I don't know if you know. For the entire month of November, we have been giving out prizes on house seats. Yes. Yes. I was was hoping I won the high roller, like the. The night with you on the high roller thing. Or oh, whatever. you want a night with me on my high roller? Okay. <laughs> this is a very dirty conversation, Heidi. Oh, my God. We're live. Well, it's okay. It's all right. Um, I'm, I'm not disturbing you at work, am I? <laughs> like, no, I'm actually on my lunch break. Oh, okay, good. Perfect. I'm debating whether I should go back. Like, oh. It's a good day to go just day drinking. <laughs> Our address is 3051 Regal <laughs> Avenue, and the door is locked, but we'll let you in while we're, we're, we're only on the air for another 15 minutes. Uh, so okay, listen, I'll, I'll, let you, I'll let you get back to work. Um, oh, I'm, okay. oh, well, no, never mind. Um, <laughs> never mind. We, we have been dying. Everyone's like, hey, come on, Bryce, come get to on. the point. Um, our grand oh. prize, we drew the name for our grand prize. And our grand prize is a 12-day cruise to Alaska, which you just won. Woo! No, seriously. I'm, I'm, you're dying. I'm like, I have a no lung space. You won. I can't even talk. You won 12 day on a cr- Alaskan no. cruise, honey. Heidi. Oh. <laughs> uh, are, you, uh, are, you, are you punking me? You're punking me, aren't you? If you go to your computer and watch VegasVideoNetwork.com <laughs> slash live, you are on right now. You might get a little feedback. Um, Shut up. You won Shut the cruise. Up. That's not. Are you serious? I am serious. 12 days. Uh, I'm not going back to work this afternoon. Okay, there we go. Like, that just went out the window. Are you serious? I'm serious. I'm totally oh serious. God. I love this. I, I feel like Ellen, Ellen right now. I yeah. Thought, I thought I I'm my shaking. I lower, you know? You, wow. honey, you won. And we haven't announced it on the site because we wanted a way to do this in person. So, well, in person, oh. and person, like, Ish. over the phone-ish. Um, so, oh, you are more than welcome to, we'll, we'll send you all the details on it. You do have to book... Between May 1st and June 30th of 2018, oh. those are the stipulations. Okay. I don't know which okay. cruise line you're going to be on yet, um, okay. but we're working on all those deals. Oh. Expedia Expedia Cruise Centers is who we're working with. Wow. They are working with us on this, oh. so I guess that's the shut best up. time to go. Is to, yes, she doesn't believe me. Just to shut up. Shut I up. I do not believe you. I think I, yeah, okay, I'm listening. Have you ever no, won anything like in your time, life? This is not a timeshare thing. This is not a timeshare thing, is it? <laughs> this is not a timeshare. You don't have to listen to me talk for any other reason. There is no catches. Listen, this is the this is the the grand prize of house seats. So. Oh my God! No, I'm in love with house seats now. Oh. I thought Carrot Top, like going to Carrot Top, was like it for me. Now this, oh my God, this is a big oh deal, God. sister. Yes. You don't even have to share a room with us or anything like that. <laughs> I was just is that what's going on? Is My husband like, thinks it would be fun to go on an Alaskan cruise, but right now this is just for you and your <gasps> whoever you're didn't take with you. I think Who? I should take my husband. Oh, I, I think you should take I your concur. husband too. I think you should take your husband. Yeah, you can take Scott. I'll get I'll get your range with Scott. <laughs> can this you is... be like my fallback in case my husband doesn't want to come? I think we'd have fun. <laughs> oh, I just got invited to my own trip. My husband says that's fine. But I think your husband would kill me. <laughs> I'm in shock. Like, I'm really so crazy. happy right now too. This is great. So listen, we'll call you back after the show. I'll have my office okay. fill in you, uh, fill in you, or fill, fill you in you. on on um, all the stuff. I'll have the cruise people call you to orchestrate <laughs> flights and all that good stuff. We'll need birth dates and things like that. So is that okay? Oh my god! Oh my god! And I gotta go online and check out that this is real. This is yeah. real. This is real. Oh my god! Well, well, well it won't be on the site yet because I have to now tell my web designer to put your name out there in the world. So now you know. All right. Oh, so now. 
everyone will now, know. Now, everyone will know Heidi. Know. Everyone will know Heidi R. That's your last name? Yeah. Heidi R. Because we're not going to give away your last R. name on the air. No. So, Heidi R. Like, my family will want to come on the cruise or something. If you yeah, it's like you won the lottery. No, them. none of them can come. <laughs> All right, we'll reach out to you in a little while. Thanks, Heidi. Woo! <laughs> it's real. Go back to lunch. Okay. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Bye. Oh, that was so cool. That was fun. I'm glad she answered when you star 67. So it doesn't say it's blocked, caller, when you call. I think if you star 67 your phone, it becomes a blocked number, right? Yeah, Some people don't answer blocked calls. I'm glad she answered blocked calls. Well, my office Delete. told her that I'd be calling her about Carrot Top. Mm-hmm. 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 Ah, that beverage was good. Ah. Well, hi. <laughs> hi. That was cool. That was great. Uh, She's a good time. I know. She was. Yeah. I th- I th- she swore right off the bat. I love it. <laughs> she, right I, off I'm the glad, bat. I'm glad we're not on a show that you can't swear on, I Heidi. thought you knew her for some reason, and then and then I was no. like, oh my gosh, no. This is exciting. That's so funny. Listen, listen we've called a few members. There's one member that won... Um, uh, there's one member that won Britney Spears tickets. Ooh. There's somebody that won Celine. We gave away some pretty awesome wow. shit. We even gave away a suite at the um, T-Mobile Arena what? so that you can bring 12 of your friends, I think 12 or 16 of your friends, to um, a show at the T-Mobile Arena and a suite. Wow. Yeah. That's cool. We didn't mess around this year. That's nice. We didn't mess around. And I, we're toying around the idea, and I know, Andy, you'd probably hate me for giving this away. Excuse me, but since since Nikki is an alum of all the set lists we have done, just about all of them, especially a lum from the first one, anyway, yeah. um, with Jagged Little Pill. We decided for the 15th anniversary, three more years for House uh-huh. Seats, that we would do a concert with House Seats. Oh. Like a like a real big show, like at a, like on a small arena, you know. Whoa, a smaller a arena, small like, arena. You know, like that's an oxymoron. You know, Orleans Arena, something like that. Yeah, that holds about you know four thousand or something like that. Wowza, four thousand people. When you want to be part of that show? Yeah. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay. Hardworking okay. Nikki C. Nikki C. <laughs> Nikki C. <laughs> Um, tell us what's happening in your world because, you know, Cocktail Cabaret is a new thing for you. It and is. And it's a new thing for those folks that are in there with you, Eric Jordan Young. Yeah. Um, some Marin, other names in there. Marin Wade. Marin, okay. And, you're, yeah, and Philip Daniel. Fortenberry is your piano? Yep. Daniel mm-hmm. Emmett and then Philip Fortenberry is on piano. And uh, yeah, it's... This is awesome to yeah, have there's this. Yeah, there's a band too. There's, there's a band. There's drums and bass and... Horn. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. And you're in sort of the, it's sort of a newly renovated barge at Caesars now because they've, they've enclosed it in the glass. They have, yes. Since, since it wasn't before, right? Right. When I, Matt was there, Matt was right. open when it Matt was, was there, op- right? It when was Matt open was when he was there, but they did have curtains. You're right, right, right. So, but now it's enclosed yeah. um, in glass, mm-hmm. which is lovely. Like a chat fishbowl. Of yes. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Do people come by and put their faces on it? Sometimes we're we're still <laughs> experimenting with closing the drapes, yeah. leaving them open. How right. does it work? Right. You know. Um, and I think it's uh, it's a lot of fun. Yeah. So it's for the cocktail hour. It's yeah. called the cocktail cabaret. Correct. This is on your way to dinner. That's or on right. On your way to a function, you're stopping right. for the cocktail hour. The party starts mm-hmm, here. Mm-hmm. Is our <laughs> tagline. That's good. Yeah. You're gonna, we're gonna, yeah, we have a little um, teaser about it okay. too. So, oh, we have, well, you're gonna be the tease. Hey, you are a tease. Nah, 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 Nick nah, nah, is the tease. Um, yeah. Before the night, there's Eric Jordan. Eric Jordan Young. He has such an amazing voice. Oh. Before she lays temptations in your way, let us enhance your mood. Daniel, adjust your attitude. The party starts right here. Oh, yeah, we'll be there at 5 today for sure. Awesome. Mm-hmm. We're going, hey, honey, you're going into the cocktail cabaret at 5 o'clock? <laughs> it's fine. I'll go by myself. You can get your, your party started. Wait, the party starts at 5. So yeah. how did this come about? Who's, who's um, the brainchild is this collectively? Keith Thompson. Of course. Of course. Yes. Yeah. And uh, yeah, I'm, I can't remember how long ago it was. It may have been about a year or just a little under a year ago yeah. that he came to me and was like, hey... You know, I have this idea for a show with like a couple of girls and a couple of guys and, yeah, you know, kind of like a Rat Packy kind of resurgent. But it's it's not Rat Pack. It's because it's the four of us. Right, so. right, right, right. And we actually don't I don't think we sing any of their songs. <laughs> but uh, yeah, there's some original music in it. Yeah. There's uh, some great 
pop favorites that you'll recognize. There's um, some, is there some musical theater? Yeah, maybe there is some musical theater. Right, and there's right. some some twist uh, twists on songs that you know really well. Right. Um, Daniel does a lot of singing in other languages. Oh. And yeah. It's like it, Portuguese? Or not like, necessarily Portuguese. Mm-hmm. Like I don't think. Uh, he does the Italian. Mm, mm-hmm. And I think he's got some Spanish. Okay. And is it a true? Is it a, just a true hour, or does the show go on a little? It's longer? It's a little longer than an hour. Okay. It's uh, it's a probably about seventy minutes. Mm-hmm, yeah. Mm-hmm. Gotcha. So yeah, so you can make your dinner reservation and your show mm-hmm, after if you really mm-hmm, want to get mm-hmm, crazy. Mm-hmm. And this has been going on just for this last week, right? This yeah, started last week. We did two shows last week, and we did two shows this week so yeah, far. So, so have, tonight yeah. is show number five. Nice. Yeah. Oh, nice. Yeah. This is it's so fun. new. And it's so cool. Cleopatra's Barge is just like, it's so cool. It's a cool venue. I mean, you've shared that. I mean, I think they even have like Paul Schaefer coming yes. up in there. They've had CeeLo Green in there recently. I uh-huh. mean, it's it's not just a barge. It's, no, and, it's and a it's, barge that's in charge. The barge is in charge. <laughs> um, yeah, and it's, yeah. it's uh, yeah, like so many greats from the past have performed there too. Right, it's right, like, right. You know, I mean, Caesars is so iconic. We just walked through there the other day because we all went to Absinthe. We hadn't, oh, we hadn't excuse me, we hadn't so seen great. that in a while. I love that show. It's so dirty. Oh, it's so funny. It is so freaking I, dirty. I remember the first time I saw it, mm-hmm. and I, it was just I, we laughed so hard because you're like, oh my god, they're they are yep. taking it there. Mm-hmm. They're gonna do it. Mm-hmm. Like it's so. They offend everyone so equally in that. Show. Yeah. Oh, absolutely. No one is spared. I think when we went, I believe at least a row of Asians walked out. <laughs> Uh, well, I don't. Maybe they didn't understand, but I, 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 they were heavily making fun of everyone, everyone, of every kind in the audience. Yeah, you know, they look at the Republican group, and you know, mm-hmm. and I think you know, there's, uh, there's that. Well, I don't want to give away the scene, but there's that pivotal scene where the two main characters uh-huh. are kind of trying to do a Cirque du Soleil type act. Yes, and you may, you may have a slip, a ball slip in there, <laughs> which you're all trying to figure out. Was that, was that, was that real? What the? Were those really his balls? Were those really his balls, Jay? If he's not even paying attention like, to what we're what? saying. Whose balls? Whose balls? His, the gazillionaire? It was his, it was all of, no, it was one of the performers. It was an act. Well, yeah, but those, were those oh. really his balls? Uh, it was all of his. They were, they were full on balls. Really? Yeah, popped, popped right out there. Wowza. Yeah. Uh-huh. And everyone's rushing to see Absinthe now. Yeah, right. They're going to come see your show first, have dinner, <laughs> yes. and then go see Absinthe. Perfect. See. It's a perfect it's dirty a perfect night. night. It's a perfect dirty night. Perfect dirty night. Get you lit. When, when, <laughs> when did you, so after, so we had you on not long ago talking about Shirley Bassey. Yeah. When you had done your show. Yes. Oh my God. Mm-hmm. And mm-hmm. she came in here and sang Diamonds Are Forever. Mm-hmm. It was so nice. Thank you. I feel like we need to like do that again. No. Well, um, if you come at five o'clock, oh, maybe you'll see oh, some of that. Hmm. Teaser. Hmm. Who's Spoiler call- alert. Is she calling me back? Is she? I don't know. Heidi's calling me back on my phone. How did she find my number? <laughs> no, it's not her. Um, so in the meantime, since then, I mean, you've been doing, you just did uh, the Christmas show with Travis yes. Clore at uh, the Italian American Club on Monday night. It was, so sold yeah. out crowd there. Sold out. Yeah. Yep. Not a noodle <laughs> not a noodle left in there. That's right. Not a noodle to slurp up. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> Your lady in the tramping. Um, yeah. And you guys, because you guys, you recorded on his Christmas album with him. Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. His Christmas album is great. I know when he set out to make it, he he uh, went with the the goal of creating that old time Christmas feel. Like right. everybody's got their favorite Christmas album, whether it's Nat King Cole yeah. or the Carpenters yep. or yeah, yeah. Andy Williams, you know, Ella Fitz, all those songs, you know, you put them on and you're all of a sudden, you're immediately transported to Absolutely. Christmas time. Mm-hmm. And he, I think he really did a great job of achieving that with his Christmas at my place. And there's, yeah. he's got some really big band sounding tunes on there. And then he's got more intimate ones. He's got choirs of kids choirs. And then, he and I do uh, a little duet mashup of uh, Marshmallow World, Winter Wonderland, and it's it's so much fun. I love that song. You know, and yeah. that's one of those songs. I think we talked about it last time when you were on here or when you were on here with Travis yeah. years ago when we first, I think that was like one of the first episodes I we know. had. Because we had, I think we were throwing marshmallows to yes, each other. I we think were. if I recall. Yeah, were. Um, yeah. We were talking about Christmas songs that people don't know and people don't know Marshmallow World. Mm-hmm. We were in the car in Virginia and we were in the car and a Christmas song came on and it was Dominic the Donkey. Ooh, the Italian Christmas yes. donkey. You know this. Oh uh, yeah, well, the Italian Christmas donkey. La la la. Is that la, it? La, 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 la. Yep. And my husband's like, "What, what the hell kind of Christmas song is this?" 
I love how he leans in when he do it again. Do it again. <laughs> no. No, no. He did no. Dominic the donkey for the... Brilliant. Dominic the Italian Christmas donkey. Aww. I'm sure they played that song at the Italian American Club. They may have in the I in think the that's one of the props of, right outside when you walk should, in for uh, Christmas. Right. We should put An that ass. one in the repertoire for yeah, next you should. year. Because I'm sure everyone would start singing. Like, I know that oh, one. Yeah. La, 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 Yeah. La, la, Anything la. in Italian. Yeah. We we did the prayer together. Of course. And, uh, oh. Yeah, we we sang that for the first time together with the, the Philharmonic at the Smith Center for oh. its inaugural Christmas oh, yes. season. It was oh, yes, yes. beautiful, yeah. magical, wonderful time. Um but yeah, we haven't done it together for a while, yeah. and so we we did it, and it was just like the crowd just like they just went, burst yeah. into applause during the Italian parts. That's the Italian. We went to um, one of the pictures, you know, he has. We went to see Kelly Clarkson oh, at yeah. uh, at for Not So Silent Night at the, at the joint um, last week, this week. Oh, was cool. that this week? When was her show? Was Sunday night, right? Kelly Clarkson was Sunday night when we got home. Yeah. Not so silent night. She she was um, she. I have never seen her live. She's amazing. And she, and it felt I'm like not she, surprised. No, and it felt like I, I I felt like she was actually singing in her living room because the way that she talks to the audience is so Ooh, so good. very personal. And uh, and yeah, and she did. She has a really awesome Christmas album out too. Cool. Oh, and we even have Jay takes video. I don't nice. I don't ever do good on video. She's very soulful. Yeah. Oh, look at us. We're dancing. Oh, she sounds good. Hell yeah. Ooh. Good for her, man. Yeah, you right? know what? She's really. Good. I, 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 the, I don't know a lot of her songs until I hear them because I'm like, yeah. oh, that's her, oh, that's her, that's her. Because I didn't pay attention to American Idol when I was a kid when right. she was on. I wasn't a kid either. Sorry. <laughs> me that neither. Was, me neither. I wasn't a kid. I was old when that show was on. <laughs> <laughs> um, but she did a really good job, and she had a. She has a really good Christmas album out there too. Nice. What do you think about favorites? When you say Christmas at your place, what does Christmas look like at your house? Well, do you have a tree? Yet? We do. <laughs> So we've recently moved, okay. and uh, the new house came with the Christmas tree. The new house came with a Christmas tree? Yes, because the ceilings yeah. are like really you, high. You walked in, and you're like, I, know, I we got were, it because the tree is here already. I know, the, the sellers were like, you can have the tree. I was like, oh my gosh, really? She's like, what am I going to do with an 18 foot tall Christmas tree? Oh my God, really? It I mean, may, it's obviously a fake tree. I don't know if it's 18, tree. yeah. Because I'm like, you can keep this tree you bought several yeah, Christmases right. ago and might burn <laughs> the house down, but <clears throat> nice. Yeah. It's already pre-lit. No, we oh, strung lights on it. Okay. Because we like these. That's a big ass tree. We you like, like these, these. ones? Yeah. These are yeah. Cute. We these are have, cute. I mean, we were all very, you know, children of the Absolutely. 80s, and we mm-hmm. liked them. You, you know, know, the ones I loved was a kid, and I have one spare strand left because they're, I guess they're a hazard. Probably. Is the, the, the lights that bubbles in them. Yes. Love those lights. Yes. Actually, I'd be like, can we go old school and put candles yeah, right. on our tree like in Germany? And then, yeah, your house yeah. will burn down. Yeah, bye-bye. Mm-hmm. Bye-bye, house. Um, <laughs> Christmas at your house. Yeah. We have one picture to show what my husband did to our house. Oh, yeah, uh, we just see. moved into this house. It looks, yeah. <gasps> Thank you, Joel, from the Christmas wow. Lights Pro for transforming our house into Candyland, I'm sure. Oh, I was going to say, yeah, uh, what are you doing later? You want to come wanna over? You want to come over? We're going to have some people over. Wow. We're going to come to your Christmas party. You're going to yes! come to our, our ga- I think we're having a gathering. He's shaking his head. No nope. Christmas. There's no date yet set because okay. there's so much going on. I know. Already, it's mayhem, right? It is. Every year it's... I'm like, you know, Christmas is coming. I'm going to hang up my tap shoes and just bake cookies all month. And that never happens. That's Gladys over there. <laughs> Gladys Scalera. <laughs> Adela mm-hmm. Stout Bernstein. Ad- oh, that's right. Yes. I remember her. I remember Adele. her from last time. Um, so we're going to wrap up. She should gonna, be on your show. She should. <laughs> she should. Is she also a puppet? Do no, you, she's like you... a real life girl. She's got hair she's... and glasses and stuff. I'd love to see this person. Send me a well, photo next time. Well, if you time. come to the cocktail cabaret, you might. I'll see you at five. <laughs> uh, that says Thursday through Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday through, through Saturday. Wednesday through Saturday, five o'clock. Five at o'clock the barge. at the barge. At the barge. Mm-hmm. You can see the lovely children Ooh. at the cocktail cabaret. And there's a two for one local oh, discount. Okay. By going to uh, you can call up. you call the box office for that one. The phone mm-hmm. number is 702-777-2782. Ooh, yeah, I just been trying to wow, tell everybody. Wow, she's a good marketer so here. All those, all those years of trying to <sighs> learn, tell them you have a local lines. ID when you come in, and you will probably yep. pay two for one. Two for one. Um, yeah, like yeah, that idea. two for one. We um, we're gonna take the last minute to honor somebody really special in our mm-hmm. lives. Um, this week we lost an amazing member of the entertainment community, mm-hmm. Maggie Di Bernardis Cup. 
Maggie moved here from New York. Maggie's in, this is a picture I remember of her forever. Maggie, I'm getting the goosebumps. Mm. Uh, Maggie, we worked with years ago uh, with Sopranos Last Supper. She did a show downtown where it was a dinner com- combined so with cool. a Soprano cast. Uh, her family is in the industry, um, and our hearts go out to her family, and mm. we love them. They're in New Jersey right now because I do believe the services are this this weekend. But we love you, Maggie. We don't have a martini in our hand right now because I know that's what you would be drinking. But from me and Nikki, (laughs) we love you. You guys have a good Friday. Cheers. Bye, Bye, everybody. Bye. Bye.